guys, what's up? It's Logan here today. We'll be Three showing you my room. Now, let me give you a quick tour. Eight of diamonds. And, uh, yeah, that's our bunk bed. This is our dresser. The TV on it. This is where our school clothes are and underwear. I don't know if you can really see it. It's right here. It's really messy. You can't really see the desk, but it's just really messy. It's dirty right now. Here's our closet. And now, wrap up for today's video. No, I'm just kidding. That's not actually our topic. Our topic is a man called Gutenberg. Now, Gutenberg is a really famous man. He, uh, inventing, he invented a great invention. Something called the printing press. Yes, that's one of the reasons why he's really, really famous. Now, uh, if you don't know what a printing press is, it's what people use to write books. Where their So their permission is absolutely beautiful. Now, he invented this in the 15th century, so a very long time ago. Bef way before George Washington was born, that's for sure. And that's in, in the 15th century, that's when the Renaissance age um, began. And the Renaissance age is when the king took absolute power. The people had, um, like, no freedom, limited feta. Um, they weren't entre entrepreneurial. They de they're dependent on the rich people and the, the king. There wasn't much discovery. It was, it was kind of like the Dark Ages. So Gutenberg, he, he, his father was a rich mer merchant. And his mother died at a, a young age, sadly. And he lived in Germany. Now, the reason why he could achieve this goal is because he, cause his father was a rich mer merchant and he got all the materials um, at G Gutenberg need, I believed. Now, once he invented the printing press, um, uh, people became were able to read and write. They started writing books of their own. And uh, they, the reason why why he invented the printing press is because before the, the printing press was invented, um, uh, they, people wrote books with their hands. Like, can you imagine writing a book with your hand? Your hand would be exhausted at the end. So it took a lot of time and effort. So the books were very, extremely expensive. So most people were illiterate. And since Schoenberg invented the printing press, um, the prices of books lowered down and pe more people became literate. So yes, that's another way he was very famous. Um, another way he was famous. Three. Now he invented the printing press by himself, which I th I think is pretty cool. Because uh, if I were to try to invent a printing press, I would need at least a crew of eight people. He he got he got his own materials. He had he um, made a printing press by himself. He it was his own original idea. And yeah, that's. Now, this is the last reason. Reason. Now, before he died, he had a shop where he wrote books and uh, where he did all this typing and stuff like that. And that's the last way he was became famous. I know. There could be other ways he became famous. But that's th those are four ways I know. Now, that'll wrap it up for today's video. And also, I like to write. I actually like to write. That's why I decided to do this video. Now, I'll probably do a video on some other prehistoric people. Uh, or maybe I'll do some, yeah, on some reptiles. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.